today is a lemongrass soap. I like to call it bless. Welcome back, soap fans. This is Lori, the soap maker behind Lori Lynn Designs. Today I am making a lemongrass scented soap called Bless. I named the soap because it is an uplifting scent. It reminds me of the big outdoors and being outside. And when I'm in the big world, I feel small and thoughtful. And although it's a little corny, it reminds me of how blessed I am. Lemongrass is similar, but not the same as citronella. They are similar in appearance as they are both big grassy type plants, but the citronella has a reddish pseudo stem. That's the bottom of the plant where it enters the dirt. And the lemongrass doesn't have a color change at all. So they both share the strong citrusy scent. However, a herbalist is sure to appreciate the nuances more than I do. In my mind, Citronella is used to repel mosquitoes and lemongrass we eat. Hmm. With that all being said, I'm using lemongrass today, not citronella. Today I'm doing a basic drop swirl. My batter is still pretty loose, so my colors are going to lightly mix together for a dreamy, swirly, light and airy feel. I'm really liking this blue teal color. It just feels so fresh and clean. The yellow gives the soap an earthy base, and the green, well, I already discussed earlier about citronella being a plant. I mean lemongrass. Eh, plants also have green bits. So now I'm thinking about citronella and bugs, so I'm going to tell you a hiking story. I like the idea of hiking. You say you are a hiker, meaning that you don't walk, you hike. You are well-traveled, you've seen some things, you're elevated. So one day my husband, before kids, when I was in better shape, suggested an eight mile hike. The trail was actually four miles to the top of the mountain. And then you were supposed to turn around and go back the way you came. Well, I didn't want to see the same thing twice. So hubby found a second way down by using logging trails. I was assured that since they all had numbers on a map, they were legit. It took us all day to hike that trail. And now I understand that a hiking mile takes a little bit longer than a mile around a track. I pretty much limped out of that forest. I was so tired. For the most part, this is a simple soap. Sometimes simple is beautiful. A touch of finely chopped lemongrass botanicals and a spritz of glitter mica finish off the soap. Here, I am unmolding my slab. Lemongrass has a tendency to cause soda ash. I can see some soda ash on the top right now, but I kinda like it. Here is cutting the slab into loaves from a new angle. You get to see the swirly sides better this way. So now we have kids. Hiking is an activity most people can be successful at. So I'm the one who suggests we go hiking. But I'm very clear on how I define hiking. I need real trails, a real signpost, preferably a map, and no strange back roads. I hope today's video blessed you. Remember, great soap doesn't have to be boring. See you next Sunday.